You're the kind of parent that recognizes the importance of buying a good quality bicycle that won't end up broken down a month from now. But you're also the kind of parent that doesn't want to spend a fortune on a kid's bike that will soon be outgrown. Does that sound like you? If so, make sure you check out the Batch Kids Bicycle. It comes in three sizes, 12 inch, 16 inch, and 20 inch, to fit kids between approximately three years and eight years old. And all sizes make a great budget bike for kids just learning to ride. First off, let's be clear. The Batch Kids Bicycle is not our favorite kids bike, but it just may be our favorite affordable kids bike. If budget's no object, this isn't the bike for you. But if you're like 99% of the population and buying an expensive bike for your child isn't your number one priority, then you'll be very happy with the Batch Bicycle. At $210 for the 20 inch version, it's similarly priced to many bikes you might find at a big box shop or on Amazon, but it's of much higher quality. The Batch Kids Bike does a good job of providing a bike that's actually enjoyable for kids to ride. The crank arms, which are 114 millimeters on the 20 inch, are appropriately sized and the wheelbase is long, which provides extra stability. Compared to a high-end kids bike like the Womb 4, the bottom bracket is still a bit high and the Q factor between the pedals is still a bit wide. Perhaps the most important thing to note in terms of the geometry are the wide and upright handlebars. This provides confidence and control for younger kids and those just learning to pedal. For older kids and more aggressive riders, the upright handlebars might be a bit much. The biggest drawback of the Batch Kids Bicycle is that it has coaster brake and no dual hand brakes. What do you think about the bike, Parker? Um, it's okay, not the best. What don't you like about it? Um, it's harder with the brakes. The coaster brake? Yeah. We're not a big fan of coaster brakes in general. They can make it harder for kids to learn to pedal, and they can also be a little bit dangerous. That said, even if a bike has coaster brakes, we generally like to see that it has a handbrake or hand brakes as well, as it provides good practice for kids to begin learning how to use a handbrake while they're still young. That said, there aren't many bikes in this price range that offer no coaster and handbrakes, so if you're on a budget, don't write the bike off. We like the single speed for younger kids, those who have yet to master riding, and parents who want a low maintenance bike. The single gear is simple and it works. The gearing is best suited for flat roads. When climbing hills, my son, who is used to a bike with gears, complained a bit about the gearing, but on flat road, he was able to cruise quickly without spinning out. The 20 inch bike weighed in at 19 pounds, which it's not the lightest 20 inch bike out there, but it's a totally respectable weight. That said, the 12 inch bike weighs 18 pounds with training wheels. So you can take the training wheels off and save a little weight, but it's still awfully heavy for a three year old to learn to pedal on. If you have a young kid, a three year old, or a petite child, then we'd highly recommend looking for a different bike that's a little bit lighter. For a six or seven year old on the 20 inch bike, they're gonna be fine. The tires on the Batch Kids bikes are fairly wide and high volume for a bike that isn't a mountain bike. The 20 inch bike, for example, has tires that are 2.125 inches. This means that the tires can be ridden at a slightly lower tire pressure than a skinnier tire and will provide better traction and more stability. The tire tread is slick, no knobbies here, so the bike is definitely better suited to pavement than to gra dirt or gravel. We're not crazy about the big bulky chain guard on the batch. Will it keep your pant child's pant leg from getting sucked into the chain? Yes, but it's overkill. For comparison's sake, here's a picture of the chain guard on the Iowa bike's knock. We were excited to see that the Batch Kids bike comes standard with a quick release seat post collar, something that's overlooked on many kids' bikes. A quick release collar means that you can quickly and easily raise and lower the seat height without any tools. The Batch Kids bike does come with training wheels, and we're not big fans of training wheels in general, but if for whatever reason you do need training wheels for your child, uh, the Batch Kids bike is a good option. A lot of the kids-specific bikes don't come with training wheels nowadays, and it's hard to add them aftermarket. So if you're looking for training wheels, consider this one. 
The bottom line is that this is a great bike for parents who are looking for simplicity and affordability. If you want a bike for your child that won't cost a fortune, will be fun to ride, and simple to maintain, then the Batch Kids bike may very well be the bike for you. For even more information about the Batch Kids bike, go visit our website, rascalrides.com. Also, please hit subscribe so you get notified when we post reviews in the future, as well as tips and tricks to help you have more fun biking with your family.